Good morning, everyone. It is 5.30 a.m. and I'm going to take you guys along as I do, you know, a little bit of holiday training here. I'm back home in Seattle and I'm preparing to head out to the Olympic Training Center next week. Um, it's going to be our training trip as, as Calman Swim. We head out to the Olympic Training Center for 15 days. It's quite the training trip and so I want to make sure that I'm in really good shape. I'm just gonna kind of take you through what I do. I'm gonna hit a weight session first and then go into the pool. We like to hit the weights first and then kind of loosen your muscles out in the pool. And so we're gonna take you through, we're gonna do a little bit of an upper body workout today. And then we are swimming around 4K in the pool today. So without further ado, I'm gonna take you guys through my routine of what I do. So you gotta get fired up a little bit somehow at 5.30 a.m. So I'm gonna show you guys the pre-workout that I'm using today, and then I'm also gonna show, be showing you the protein powder that I use after my workout. It'll help me fuel my body uh, until I get that next meal in. Um, so yeah, here's, here we go. like to put a little bit of ice in my pre-workout kind of chills it up I don't know, comment below if you guys do that maybe I'm just crazy who knows so I'm gonna be using some Bipro Elite um, in between the workout the weight session and the swim session um, like I said just to kind of fuel the muscles make sure that I have enough energy in my body so while I do that long 4k swim all right we got the pre-workout we got the protein powder let's get off to the gym all right, we're at the gym now. We're gonna hit some of the pre-workout. We're gonna go inside and hit a dynamic warm-up, get the muscles loose, and then we're gonna get into the lift. Let's go. All right, we're here really early in the morning. We wanna make sure that you guys can, you know, see every type of the movement, all the workout that we're doing, so there's like not that many people in the gym. We're gonna start with a dynamic warm-up. Let's go. So as I mentioned to you guys in my prior videos, I have like a bit of a shoulder injury. So we're gonna start by warming up my shoulders before we get into some more upper body work. And then we're gonna hit some cleans later in the workout and then a core workout at the end of it. Let's go. Stretch out and loosen up the abs after a quick 
for a workout. We're gonna hit that circuit a couple times. That was really cool. So that's what kind of like a morning workout would look like with a weight session and then a little bit of core at the end of it. Now we're about to go hit a swim workout. We're gonna loosen out those muscles. We're gonna hit around 4,000 meters today. And then that's gonna be the workout for today. Onto the swim workout now. Um, doing a little bit of stretching before I get in. Uh, it helps with my hurt shoulder. Also gonna be drinking a protein shake. See, kind of looks like a little weird, but it's really good. I really like it. Um, Bipro has really good protein powder, not an ad or anything. Um, we're gonna get into the swim workout uh, after I do some stretches. Yeah, so let's get into it. So we're gonna start out with a 400 flop, just kind of loosen up the muscles. After that, we're gonna go into a 200 IM drill, and then a 200 kick, and I'm gonna do 450s building into it, kind of get the heart rate up so I can get ready for the main set. Um, this is my gear bag. We're going to start off today using some fins. So these are my fins. Um, just kind of like to get, you know, help build into the workout. Slowly as we get into the workout, I'll take them off and then I'll put them back on when I want to get in some speed later. So without further ado, let's go. Oh, I never put it on right. Let's go. Done with the uh, done with the 400 flop. Now on to the 200 IM drill. Now we're gonna do a 200 kick, 100 with a board, and then 100 without a board. So I'm kind of like messing around, just seeing what works. Today we're going to do a 4,000 yard workout, so the first 1,000 is just going to be kind of like warm up, get their heart rate up, then we're going to go into some like aerobic swimming, we're going to do five 200s. Then after that, we're going to try and work on a little bit of backstroke and freestyle work for another 1,000, and then we're going to get the heart rate up and do a little bit of sprinting for the last 1,000. So next up we have 450s descending. The goal is to have all of them under 30. It's short course meters. Um, so we're gonna descend 30 all the way down to like 27. Taking off the fins. Let's go. So during workout, normally I'll drink um, Vitargo, which is like a carbohydrate drink. Um, I don't have any right now, but we will have some of the Olympic Training Center. It kind of just helps you sustain your carbs throughout the workout. It's really cool, and if any of you guys are interested, here's my disco count down below. Without further ado, we're gonna get into the next set. Um, wanted to get a little bit of aerobic work in today, so we're doing five 200s pull on three minutes. It's short course meters, so a little bit longer than the yards version of it. We're gonna be using some pulling equipment. Let's get into it. So up next, we're gonna have another set, but I wanted to make sure everyone, you gotta stay hydrated while you're swimming. Whether you believe it or not, you're actually burning a lot of calories and you're sweating a lot while you're swimming. I know you probably can't feel it since there's water all around you, but you're sweating a lot. So it's really important to hydrate during workouts, keeps you ready for what's next and make sure that you don't cramp during the workouts. So my editor, Kate, she just left. She's gonna go work out. So the rest of the workout's gonna be filmed by me. So what we have next is we're gonna do a set of five 100s. Um, we're gonna do them three back and we're gonna do negative split. So negative split meaning that the second 50 has to be faster than the first 50. And then we're gonna do 10 50s, two of them butterfly, four of them backstroke and four of them freestyle. And again, working on that second 25 negative splitting all of them. All right, 
so we're at 3,000 meters now. Now we have another thousand left. We have a hundred beefy, which is build easy, fast, easy. And then a hundred in between that. Then we're gonna do that again. And then we have four 25s on 30, building dolphin kicks underwater to 15. We start out at like 80% and then get it better to around 95% or fast-ish. And then after that, we're gonna do some pace and then that's gonna be at 4,000 meters. it for today. Good 4,000 meter swim. Uh, now I gotta go get some carbohydrates in me. But first, we're gonna hit the hot tub. All right, finishing the workout in the hot tub. Trying to just relax the muscles. Um, gotta fuel up with some carbohydrates after practice. Make sure to get in some energy to replenish your body. Um, that's gonna be it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure to stay tuned. Next week I head out to the Olympic Training Center in Colorado Springs. Gonna have a lot of fun content there. Make sure to like and subscribe, and until next time, go Bears.